Hello everybody, welcome back to another AI video. In this one, I'm in Runway ML. This is a free to use video editor that's built around all sorts of amazing AI tools. And in this one, I'm gonna show you how to add subtitles to your videos in seconds. This is very, very quick to do. And I'm gonna show you a final copy here of what it'll look like, and then I'll show you the process step by step. Let's hit play and see what we got. I'll tell you what I'm blathering about. I've got information, man. All right, the big Lebowski. Lebowski's got some information. How did I get those subtitles on? Let's just go through it step by step. It'll take a few seconds, not very long. All right, first step, runwayml.com. I will put a link in the description below. This is the software and it's browser based, which is really, really cool. Now I'm going to click on login. If you don't have an account, you can click on sign up. It is free, a very, very important point. It's free to use. All right, now I've got a whole bunch of projects here, so you can only have three projects at once. So I'm gonna delete these two just so I have some extra breathing room here. And then presto. Now on the left side, you'll see here we got create new project and we've got AI magic tools. This is a magic tool, click on magic tools. Once you do that, you're gonna get a whole row, a bunch of columns of different options. The one we're looking for is on the, eh, it's about five columns down and it's right here, generate subtitles. Also, you can generate transcripts as well. But I'm gonna do the subtitles here. I'm gonna click on this and when you do that, you're gonna get this screen here. And if, it, you're, if this is your first time using this software, you won't see any of these things beneath here. But what I'm gonna do now is as I can drag and drop a file here. So I'm gonna go into my finder and I'm gonna got, I got, I'm gonna find my big Lebowski video and I'm gonna just drag and drop it right there. And in a few seconds, it'll be ready to go. And it's going to automatically generate and it's gonna load up my timeline. It's a little slow today because a lot of people are using this tool, but yeah, just stick with it, it'll, it'll work. Okay, good, now it's loading up and here we go. We're gonna go ahead and start creating our subtitles. So let's just load it down here, where are you? Come on, I'll come back when it's ready. It might take a few seconds. All right, here we go. So now I've dragged and dropped it in and we've got our generate subtitles. Keep in mind, if this, if this times out on you, you may have to hit the reset button because again, it's being overwhelmed with a lot of, a lot of people are on its uh, server. So anyways, the next step here is very, very simple. It's just click generate. And when you click generate, you're gonna get this little flashy dashy thingy dingy. And then once this is done loading, it, there's two steps to this. We can just go ahead and finish up the subtitles. I'll come back. Oh, never mind. I'm not even coming back. It's all ready to go. Now, here we go. It's very, very simple. It's already done it. Let's hit spacebar and see what we got. I'll tell you what I'm blathering about. I've got information, man. It's done a very good job. That said, if you if you if it's not quite where you want it to be, keep in mind that you can go ahead in here and make some changes. So I'll tell you what I'm instead of saying blathering, let's say blabbing about. Let's say that's what he said in it. I've gone ahead and made changes, and you'll see here that it's represented in the uh, text. You can also make changes to the start and stop time. So right now it's done it automatically, but if you want to adjust it, you can. You could just go in here and say instead of 2.62. I want to be 2.60, hit spacebar, or hit enter, pardon me, and you'll see that it's adjusted it here. You can adjust these on the timeline, so if you want this to start maybe somewhere around here, or maybe it's too long, this is kind of just like standard video editor stuff. You can just go in and make those appropriate changes. Also, lastly, I'll show you here that you can click on them, and up at the top here, you can go ahead and make some changes to the property. So if I go to the layer, right here, like I've done before, go to the layer. You'll see here under preset styles, there's a triangle, drop that down and you can make a few small changes. So if you want it with black background, or if you want it to be yellow and things like that, you can go ahead in here and make changes, including changing the font, changing the size, changing the weight, all of those things are available, standard stuff, guys. That's how you create subtitles and adjust subtitles for free using AI tools, Runway ML, it's free. And then last step, Click on export and click the resolution and you're on your way. Thanks for watching.